Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So the latest Patch Tuesday cumulative update for Windows 10 KB5014699 is rolling out, and this update was made available by Microsoft on the 14th of June 2022. And the Patch Tuesday updates are your compulsory mandatory security updates, which will be downloaded and installed automatically onto your device. And once your device has restarted um, after the update has been uh, installed, uh, if you are interested, the update will be listed under Quality Updates, Cumulative Update for Windows 10, KB5014699. And these updates are also known as B-Release Updates, uh, which roll out on the second Tuesday of every month. And there are no major improvements and changes with KB5014699. This is, as mentioned, mainly a security update that is rolled out for Windows 10 versions 21H2, 21H1, and 20H2. And Microsoft also mentions that um, on the 19th of May, they released an out-of-band update, which I did post a video on, to address an issue that might cause machine certif certificate authentication failures on domain controllers. And they mentioned that if you didn't install that out-of-band update, that it will be... Um, rolled out and bundled in this Patch Tuesday update that rolled out on the 14th of June. Now, as mentioned, the Patch Tuesday updates are um, security updates, and this um, latest update does address those security issues in Windows 10, so it's, it's an important update in regards to security. And just to mention quickly some of those uh, vulnerabilities that have been addressed in total, there are 29 vulnerabilities that have been fixed with this latest update. Two of those are critical, which is your highest ranked vulnerability, and 27 are important. And that's for Windows 10 specific security vulnerabilities. And um, Microsoft also does make mention that um, uh, in the release notes, they just make mention of one vulnerability, CVE 2022301. 154, which they say addresses an elevation of privilege vulnerability for the Microsoft File Server Shadow Copy Agent Service. So uh, that has also been addressed in these latest security updates, which, as mentioned, 29 vulnerabil vulnerabilities in total have been addressed for Windows 10, and two of those are critical. And then if you didn't uh, download the um, optional C release update that rolled out um, on the 2nd of June, those um, uh, improvements. Um, that were part of that update, which was KB5014023. Um, uh, have also been bundled with this latest Patch Tuesday update, KB5014699. And um, I will leave a link down below uh, to that video, but just to do a quick recap in case you missed that, uh, those uh, that update addressed several issues in the operating system, including apps, and games that were crashing, memory leaks, slow file copy operations, and had numerous fixes. So uh, if you uh, didn't install uh, that optional C-release update that rolled out at the beginning of this month for Windows 10, all those fixes will be bundled with this latest update, 5014699. And if you have any issues installing the update through Windows Update, you can always head over to the Microsoft Update Catalog where you can download the update and install it manually. And... Um, if you are running Windows 10 version 21H2 after the update has been applied, your OS build will now be 19044.1766, which is the latest version and build um, for the Windows 10 operating system. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.